<sighs> DC. Oh, mm-hmm. boy. Do you want to do this now? James Gunn News. <laughs> oh, look, Torian, it's your time to shine, bro. What's that? What's that <laughs> All right. Uh, so, if you guys want a Batman Beyond movie, right? Mm-hmm. We were so. We, uh, who would be the best animators? What was the best? Anim- first, I'm gonna ask you this first. What was the best animation this for the last year, two years? The Spider Verse. So, what if the Spider Verse animators and writers wanted to do a Batman Beyond and has been pitching DC and James Gunn for the last six months to do a Batman Beyond animation? Is what it the is, is, it's the Spider Verse? It's the same person who made Spider Verse? No, you're. I didn't even read that part. Really. Yeah. Okay, so James Gunn doesn't uh, James Gunn doesn't want it. Nope. Oh, I'm gonna this guy. Well, I, I don't know if it's James Gunn doesn't want it or the studio didn't wouldn't green light it or like they they've been pitching it and like they or like they said okay. no and I like have, I have the, the the official quote uh before they pitched it uh, uh, before they pitched it and did the animation for it. Aaron, could you pull up the pictures that like they them. did? Yeah, 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 I have them. I have them uh, yeah. before they pitched it. They pitched this movie to them, and they pitched. Uh, they had they showed them the animation. And they've been pitching it for like six months, and they've been going to the lore and trying to get to James Gunn. So, mm-hmm. and they were warned that there is no, absolutely no way they can Absolute. do a Batman Beyond movie. That they love to, uh, uh, they they loved our immersion of the Batman Beyond, but there's no possible way that this film is going to happen. Okay, can I can I tell you? how hurt i am by this yeah because same. number one i love batman beyond from the early cartoon days of batman beyond really got me hooked on batman beyond mm-hmm. so one i'm hurt at that two you're telling me the people who did the into the spider verse and across the spider verse pitch this it looks like this which i hate to say looks identical in animation style to across yeah. the spider verse <laughs> and J- and this is not getting greenlit to go no. for some no. reason no yeah. not for some reason number one they this have not. Crazy. They have not finished Mo- Miles Morales at this point. Uh, uh. They are afraid to have both of these things competing with each other in the market and mm. whatnot. And we are still potentially looking to a live action Miles Morales, which may or may not happen. So they don't want to invest in this thing at this point when they've got something else going on. Now, but you know, it's two I different. Mean. It's two different studios, though. Listen, it's Sony. It's so it, yeah. this is Miles, Miles Morales has nothing to do with Marvel, so that's Marvel, Sony. Yeah. With MCA, so if you want to, right? if you want to, if you want to beef with Sony and you're DC and you're the DCU that James Gunn wants okay. to do. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's 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 just put this another way. Forget that you know anything about anything. After you've seen the success of the Spider Verse, would you really want to compete with a new art with a new character that you don't know? In, in in the same market at the same time. Yes, we've had two ridiculously successful multiverse movies with Miles Morales. Do I really want to now try to go in competition with that? Who if is the other? Or, what, who is the other Batman that's more famous than any other Batman? And what other cartoon did the best ratings I, I ever? Know. It was Batman Beyond. It was one of the best cartoons that came out for Batman. Okay. What, what's that what we're talking about though? We're talking about. The fact that there's already two animation movies with Miles Morales and potentially yeah doesn't matter you know, a lot two different of different stories coming so so this thing's already blown up so now I have to introduce this character to people who do not know not to us we we know but the people who've never seen this I have to now introduce mm-hmm. this character and try to get the same amount of audience in there do I really two different to- studio but the thing is it's two different studios. Two That's different, not. complete, completely two different characters. Even more the point, mm. even more the point. If it's two different studios, that means that I'm competing. Do I really want to compete with the Miles Morales animation that's had, that's this big right now? Do I really want to do that? Is Miles Morales, did Miles Morales come out this year yet? It doesn't no, matter. No, it's, it's, two, not, it's not gonna. It's not gonna come out until next year. It's got two ridiculously it, big, successful it, movies. Do I? But really you have the same that? people. But you have the same people that did Miles Morales. Do Two this. Studios. You just said it. Two different studios. But, but no, it's the same people that are doing the same people Two, that did Miles Morales. They are doing this, so it will come out the same way. They did the artwork. They have the script and they have the thing. 
Still two different studios. The thing Spider-Man, is, they don't want to spend money. That's what it is. Listen, they 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 don't want to. They don't want to. They don't want to spend the money. They don't want to lose the money. You know what I mean? Because and you think don't... Superman Legacy is gonna make money? I, I, well, I don't know. You have to talk to James Gunn about that, bro. Like, <laughs> you know. I think James. I, I think I think Superman Legacy is gonna make some money. I don't know about how much, but I think it's yeah. gonna make some money. I mean, the only reason money, it, 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 it's gonna it's gonna make money the first. Oh no, no, wait, wait. The the reviewers or the the critics are gonna go see it first, hype it up the same way they did the Flash, and then when mm-hmm. the comic book heads and the fans go in there and say, "This movie is a piece of shit." <laughs> No, listen, dude. I don't know, man. And then it's gonna fucking drop to the fucking tank. It's gonna drop to the fucking basement again. Listen, we we all know that don't care comics loves to hide behind the chainsaws, bro. And there's a running car. We we know this already. So, you know, you know, we we don't we we already have to discuss this. Like, there's so many simple things that DC Comics could have done in the movies with these stories to make them great, and they mm-hmm. didn't do it. That's why I named them Don't Care Comics, because they don't care. You know, James Gunn, with all due respect, is just doing what he wants to do up there. And you know, Superman Legacy, like, okay, bro. Let's let's see what that's about. Can I can I just so first off, I just want to say these images are fucking dope. That's yeah. first off. These images are sick. They if this cool. is what if this is what this would have been, um, this is not so like. First off, I just want to say, I don't know, like, you guys are kind of debating who's responsible for it not occurring, whether that's DC Studios, whether that's the animation studio, this, whatever. But either way, what I'm trying to say is, first off, fuck you, DC, for not putting some version of Batman Beyond out there, because I guess I'll really give a shout out to Ezra Miller for ruining any potential of a Batman Beyond live action. Because screw you, because your movie was so bad, we didn't get Michael Keaton as you know the pre- the the fucking old whatever, man in, Batman as old man Batman for Batman Beyond. So fuck you, Ezra Miller again, which I say constantly. And then second off, if you weren't going to do it that way, this way having a new iteration of Batman Beyond like this would have been incredible. But if we're not going to fund it, yeah, I guess well, that everybody just loses, right? How about that? We all just I, lose I, and don't get to see it. How about I, that? I'll tell you, I'll tell you what. I I DC lose. elsewhere, I would love it. At DC That's what elsewhere. I would fucking love to see. But they won't. Listen, I'd love to see I it. I don't care where it goes. Mm-hmm. The, the other thing is that if you look at the uh, look at the character there, take the points off his ears. Doesn't doesn't he sort of look like Miles Morales? I mean, yeah, but that's, that's the animation been, style. That's, that's I mean, but that's what I'm saying though. The, I'm, I'm that's saying always been his look since the beginning. <laughs> look, look, look. That that could be Miles Morales walking down the alley, bro. But no, but you gotta realize Batman Beyond came before Miles Morales. They don't give a yeah. damn. Like the business, yeah, so it's like, it's, the business don't care. The business does not care who came before. Exactly, but before. Marvel and DC always been biting off of each other. So that's not that's not even here or there. We can say okay, Superman. If you have, they've been biting off of each other for this forever. You know, they don't. They don't want to. They don't want to invest in a duplicate in the market at the same time that one's already super, super successful. Because if this thing fails, bro, like the the amount of money in animation alone, the team that you have to put together to make this thing, if this thing, like whole generations of DC are gonna get fired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. We won't yeah. be able to buy comics. <laughs> what, do you yeah. think, what do you think is gonna happen when this fucking Superman Legacy comes out? Well, <laughs> uh, yeah, he, he has two years, bro. He has two to three years, maybe tops. <laughs> yeah, to make a to make a DCU uh, yeah. palatable. Uh, All right. Uh, I, oh, you have any so comments? You, so, um, I think we did have some comments on this. Hang on. Batman Beyond live action would rival Iron Man or Spider Man, in my opinion. Really, I, I think if Keaton was the old man Batman, yeah, it really would have been something. It mm-hmm. really would have been something fucking cool. But again, DC writing it, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, it's just it's one of those things that like could have mm-hmm. been really. I would have cool, believed like, Batson as Batman Beyond. Put it that. Oh, way. you know what though? You're not wrong. <laughs> I actually could have believed that. A little, a little emo. Well, yeah, a, little, a, little, a little emo didn't know what he was doing <laughs> really know, like you know, like, thank you not not wrong you're not <laughs> thank you i wouldn't be able to accept him fucking hitting the bus yeah i'm driving <laughs> 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 <laughs>